Hello guys, um, today uh, my video is about uh, about a helmet. I'm gonna go purchase a helmet today. Uh, I I have a open helmet, uh, open face helmet. So I decided to pick up a full face helmet, uh, which is I need it for my longer rides. So I'm here in one of the shops in Lalbagh Road in Bangalore. So I looked up quite a lot of helmets and this is the one I kind of shortlisted and I quite liked it. So probably I'll zero down on this, but uh, that's how it looks. Uh, so that got a hazard light behind. Uh, it's got three modes. Uh, one is static blink and then it's got uh, two other modes for fast blinking and uh, uh, slower blink. Uh, yeah, it fits well. Uh, it's it's quite light. Uh, it's comfortable inside. It's got good padding for the uh, jaws, chin. So uh, I quite liked it. Uh, and uh, the front, the the visors are hundred percent UV protected. So yeah, and the the one outside one as well as the inner visor both are hundred percent UV protected. And uh, yeah, so and and it's it's also uh, anti fog, so which almost uh, all those helmets, uh, uh, recent helmets, all of them have that. But uh, which is very important. No, anti fog because uh, usually when you ride early morning or not even early morning, I mean, it's a still moist environment, you get that fog, so it becomes a little difficult to ride. This is another model of Soul, uh, which is very close to the one I selected, but this does not have the Zahazar light behind, and the shape also a little different, it's got a little. Uh, uh, like a spoiler kind of a band. It's quite nice. Uh, it looks nice, but somehow I still I kind of like the one I selected. Uh, this is an LS2 with a Bluetooth integration integrated uh, model. Uh, so this is a new one. Uh, I've seen a older LS2 the Bluetooth which was actually a mount on the side left side of the helmet but this is uh, the Bluetooth uh, uh, system is actually integrated on the belt the buckle um, and uh, yeah uh, it, it's nice helmet I like it uh, but it is heavier than the uh, sole helmet which I picked up so I was not so keen about it because I want something light on my head so it's nice but not my type so I have zero down on LS sorry the sole helmet and um, looks like I'm gonna pick up that itself uh, only only thing which I kind of didn't like it it's that uh, the inner visor uh, slide up slide down uh, slider is on right on top of the helmet which is not very smooth um, but it's okay I mean probably have to get used to it but yeah that's something uh, I don't, didn't like it much but yeah apart from that uh, Everything is good about this helmet. So all 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 parts, chin and replacements are available. So I'm planning to keep an extra front visor additional with me just in case uh, I need one. All right, so I'm done with the purchasing of the helmet. And this street around 100 200 meters on the left side as well as the right side, you'll see a lot of helmet shops. So you get all kind of brands. So yeah, I think more than buying a helmet crossing the road is quite difficult here because it's a very um, crowded place and the traffic is crazy out here. So so you should wait for your turn and right find the right opportunity and run 
and that is how we cross this road all right so guys i'm back home uh, with the helmet and uh, uh, the guy who gave me the box it's not the same model box so it's uh, the helmet which I bought it's uh, SM1 uh, you can look it up on the uh, on the Seoul website so the helmet comes with its own jacket so when you're not using it you can put it put the cover and put keep it aside to you know, it not won't get dusty and all that so let me take it out from the jacket so I did two things after getting the helmet. Uh, I mounted uh, my uh, camera chin mount. Uh, I mounted the bracket uh, onto the chin of the helmet because that's the best location which I like. And uh, and I also integ uh, also fitted my Bluetooth BT2 model on left side. That's my daughter. She loves the light as well. Uh, like I do she loved it so yeah so that's a uh, main visor outside visor and the internal one and sorry guys about the light I didn't realize I was shooting on low light uh, sorry about that and I'm not sure if you guys can see that when I'm sliding the inner uh, shade visor but it, it's pretty much when you're wearing the helmet it pretty much covers uh, up to your nose tip which is good and yeah it's got plenty of air vents which are very very good uh, I, I try riding in a small ride with this, wearing this helmet and I could feel the breeze I could feel a little slight breeze on my forehead when I was wearing it because right now the climate is very hot so I could really f uh, feel a difference so that's the mount, uh, my action cam mount, which I did some jugard to fix it because uh, uh, the chin side of the helmet was a little curvy. So I, the 3M adhesives are not sticking that properly. And that's my Bluetooth uh, mic inside. And the speakers inside. Yeah, so that's, that's, I've aligned it as per my ear. And that's dot approved and a few more air vents. Yeah, so that's guys, that's pretty much uh, about this helmet. Uh, hope you like my video. Uh, if you like it, please give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more videos like this, uh, please do subscribe. And take care and ride safe. Cheers, guys.